la da di da do 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 singing i'm crooning like like robert goulet or at least will ferrell's impersonation of robert goulet that's what i was doing there oh shit where's my uh I need to get my volume adjust going here because i hear myself just need to make sure that i'm getting my uh levels on my lappy top taken care of because I see myself and I hear myself, that means we are locked in and live, ready and recording. So welcome back in, everybody. FIFA 19 here with you. We have a pro career going, an individual player career. Of course, Dylan Lancaster from the Cayman Islands. Um, advanced, I didn't do anything. I just wanted to show the picture of him. It's been a while since I've played this. So I'm a little off. Not sure what I'm doing here. But we got past our, uh, our friendly final... If I remember right. Which, uh, is it what I wanted to look at? Yeah, we beat Chicago. And all this time off, pretty much, you know, one, two... Uh, not quite two weeks off, but the Houston Dynamo, that's our next opponent. So let's get that taken care of right now. Let's, let's just do this. Yeah, I want to play that game. Starting off here with our uh, yeah, Atlanta United FC. Um, away? Sure. I mean, I do kind of like our home jerseys. Kind of that black and red stripe looking good, but all whites. You know, for them, let's, uh, yeah, let's, let's get them, like, more solid. So it's absolutely distinctive one from the other. So if they're wearing, like, all solids... Anybody like a white striping or white trunks or whatever? Shorts. Lancaster, that's right. Our goalie is rank 80. That fucker's pretty good, huh? Yes, play as Lancaster. That's what I want to do. Because that's the guy I made, and that's who we're going to be representing here. Represent. No one knows what that's all about. Ground pass. Okay. There you go. There's another. Yeah. Oh, that's right. Uh-huh. Oh, boy. That's right. Um, that's excellent. Okay, I was not really trying. I did better than Epic Shots. And Des Boy. That's odd, because I thought that they were, like, FIFA nuts. Jersey B ain't been playing? What? Oh, they just never did that specific thing. I'm gonna do one more. Retry. No. That's right. Bonus score. 71. I, I don't think that was good. Let's do one more. also quickly is going to help us. <laughs> Sailed the fucker. 7,000 exactly. Whatever, we're done. Advance! I want to, like, bury everybody. All of my friends who play this. Who have done that drill. I want to be that arrogant son of a bitch. Like, this motherfucker MJ. Still try and try. You know? Please not the business. Don't you worry about your dynamo. Here is our Houston Dynamo lineup. Number 18, Chris Sykes. Number 20, Look at these guys. Four goals in the previous match. Leonardo. Yeah, didn't we? We just opened them up pretty good. Number seven. Wow. the smallest guy on my team. Ooh. 
After every name, they cheer like that. Yay! Yeah, eat a bucket of dicks. Fuck you. Fuck you. Kiss his ass. Kiss his ass. Kiss my ass. Fuck you. Happy Hanukkah. Number 62. Dylan Lancaster. Now, Houston versus Atlanta. I don't know how well the, uh, the, the fan ship, the crowd ship is there. Thank you for joining us. I, I wasn't that big. I couldn't even see myself. Apparently, I'm not the smallest guy out there. I was standing in the back row. All right, start it up here. Yay, there's your fucking kickoff. Now, see, I've been playing a lot of NHL 19, so, like, my whole brain thought of, like, positioning and all that shit is kind of like I, I, I'm in a different headspace now. Okay, okay. Good pass, they say. They say good pass. I say, hey man, nice shot. Oh boy. Oh no. Up, oh, up. Oh. oh, there you go, kid. There you go. Oh no. I mean, if he would have went between the legs, and how tough is that, right? I mean, barely. Fuck, that almost went in anyway. I'm more towards the middle. Where am I at? Oh, shit. God damn it, no. Hustle back on defense. Fush, there you go. Goddamn, get some stamina going here, huh? No, 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 no. Not good enough. It's okay, it's okay. Shit. Just not paying attention. Oh, whoa. What? Whoa, 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 hold on. Handball, right? He kicks it. It go, dude. That should be a goal either way. It fucking hit the guy in the hands. That's some bullshit corner kick. Oh shoot! Ah! Damn it! Oh, it's going our way. All right, all right. Not paying attention. I'm not gonna lie to you. Fuck. Oh, we're good. All right. Good keep. Good keep. Ah, uh, no. Not gonna get the goalie on that shit. But in playing a lot of NHL 19, I feel that. Oh my God, guys, get on your fucking game here. Go get him. Just go get in his way. It's like defensive positioning and all that shit. And the movement in this game is so goddamn fluid. It's so beautiful in this game. I don't feel like I'm ever cheated. Like, if I fuck up, it's because I didn't make the right cut, the right agile move. Oh. I mean, just a fucking whisper. Slower. I mean, that was a beautiful... Oh, he was offsides, though. Wouldn't have mattered. Can't see where I'm at. I don't know. Ah, uh, shit. Where are the other defenders? I'm, I'm midfield. I should be a midfield defender. And I'm like, damn near one of the last guys back. That weak ass shit. What are you guys doing? Well, oh, put it on the ball. There we go. Yeah, the camera focus on me. I don't need that shit. Where are we setting up to? Oh, well, they want me over here.
Nice passing. Well, thank, thank you. I try. Where you guys going? Where's the setup? What are you doing? Oh, I was back. All right, that's cool. No, that was dumb. You could have gave it to me. Give me the feed in. Fucking murder people. What a fucking murder people. What did you do that for? Oh my god. How did that go right through me? That's got to be going our way now. Unless he bumped it out. Shit. A good play there. He tried. Lord help him. Put it back on the ball. I don't need to be the camera focus guy. Ah, shit. Run a straight line. Don't don't chase. Make that straight line cut. You know, I'll, and I'll be looking at that like, not to say that I was anything fucking great for it, but I was in a flag football league with a couple of guys that I work with. There we go. There's the goal. But, um, you know, the typical thing would happen where I always make, I say it in NHL 19 because that's just how the fucking AI is in the game. And it's like, everybody just chases after the puck. Like, if you ever watch, like, little kids play soccer, everybody goes after the ball. There is no, like, positioning. There is no fucking, you know, trying to line up one way or the other. No, it's just, just go after the ball. Or go after the puck in NHL 19's fucking problem. But that would happen where, in this flag football league, if it, it, our team was not good by any stretch of the imagination, but, uh... Let's just say our quarterback throws an interception and if the other team starts laddering the ball or some shit like that, we're just all flooding after the ball. Just follow the, like a snake trail, right? Just follow the ball. No, no, no. I'd be the only guy that's like, no, 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 he's trying to get a touchdown. <laughs> the end zone is this way in a straight line. I don't care that he's over this way weaving between people. I'm going to go towards the end zone where he wants to get to. I'm not going to follow him. If other people can get to him and slow him down and do all that shit, fine. You know, pull the flag, stop him completely. That'd be great. That really would be. Ah, shit. Ah, double shit. Oh, boy. Ah, shit. What? No, 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 no. That was not a handball. Oh, Jesus Christ, we're out of position. All right, catch your breath and reset. Oh, shit, come on. Too many fucking guys there. Guys close in on him. God damn. Like, I'm playing really far back deep. Why did you roll the ball to him? I mean, there's this lot of this fucking ticky tack passing. There's nothing doing. Nothing doing there. Ha-ha! Shit. All right, blue shoes. Gotta help me out here. Boy, it's like, we get that lead. Oh. Yeah, just help him out here. Just help him out. Ah, fucker. Lead, walk up, run, okay, something, something. Oh, no, 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 no. Straight line, just sprint. All right, there you go, good, good. Two guys slowing him down. And I'll get him on the fucking, on the pickup. No, 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 no. Okay. Oh, boy. There you go. Hammer it. All right. That's all right. That's all right. That's all right. They always do that clear out fucking bullshit. 
I don't know why they sail it out of bounds on purpose. I mean, yeah, it won't go for a corner. Again, the fucking inbound pass, and you're doing that shit. Oh, boy. What? No, 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 no. Blue shoes. Why weren't you fucking following in with me? Yeah, 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 yeah. Ho ho! Jesus Christ. Man. Sometimes we just struggle to get past fucking, you know, midfield. I'm gonna say half court, but. Alright, come on, fellas. Trying to get too fancy with okay, okay, now you got two of you. That guy just shoving me. Oh nothing. I gotta get stronger. Oh shit. Oh boy. I mean look at how quickly they went down. Oof. Sucker. Oh, Jesus Christ. Guys. Like, our defense is just getting fucking burnt. Get out of the way. Yeah, I'll tackle you. Okay, push it up, push it up. God damn it. There's two guys pinching me. You're going to fucking try to slip one to me. Come on, terrible. Straight line, guys. Yeah, don't even take that slanted angle. Don't, you're not going to get there in time. Like, they're really on the fucking press here. Don't fucking give it to me. Two guys around me again. And you can tell I'm really not skilled. Oh, there you go. Try whatever you got to do. Try whatever you got to do. That was beautiful. That was just a hell of a kick. And I like being there when someone scores a goal. I like being in the mix. Holy shit. Texture just flying in. Whoops. Uh, Goal at Lido oh. United. Number that send. That send. All right. Oh, intercepted. It could go. All oh, that. No, we ain't got the speed for that shit. Oh, where are you going? Where are you going? <laughs> I mean, I literally shoved him. No, not him. I wanted the down angle. What the fuck? Everything go flat. Dude, you're getting burnt all the time. Y'all are going to have to clear that shit out of there. I'm just trying to box somebody out like I'm Dennis Rodman fighting for a rebound. Now spread out the defense a little bit. Something. Just keep doing these passes, you know, four feet away from each other. There's a good lineup. He doesn't have it, though. Shut me up. Wow. Another long fucking bullet of a kick.
tries the text rolling in very quickly with back-to-back -back goals. <clears throat> Three to nothing, yeah. I know, maybe this is not the best watch for anybody. Because, like, I, I don't know, it's it's not online versus other people, and that's what everybody just wants to watch. Good setup. Oh, man, the goalie got kicked. All right, well, let's set it up. I have to sneeze again. Oh, man, that guy read it nice. You have no idea how fucking terrible my allergies have been the past two to three weeks now. Here we are, uh, February 27th of 2019. I don't think I've played this since last year, honestly. So happy new year to everybody. Oh boy. What the fuck are you guys? Here, let me just baby pass it to this guy. Fucking hammer that shit out of here. Goddamn believable. Guys, guys. I, like, I don't know what our strategy is right now. It's like, we just seem to get that one fucking power surge. But they honestly look like they've been in so much better control than us. Without question. Oh, a little boot out. Going their way. As the texts roll in. Got to. Ugh. Woo! Right, how they do. Oh, it wasn't even a corner kick, beg your pardon. Oof. Yeah, I was going to say, why don't you just hammer the fucking ball out like their goalie does? Oh, good little float up. Good sweep, good sweep. I'll hand it to him. He read it. Positioning. Trying to find my way. Do something with it, would you? Oh boy. Nice pass. Oh, you like that, did you? Oh shit. Now they're gonna say I'm way out of position. There you go, kid. There you go, kid. All right, that was a pass leading to the assist. Uh, that was pretty good. That was pretty good. To him, I thought he was going to take the shot, but beautifully done. Woo. Whoops. Try to get my texts out of the way quickly. But that's not a that's not a prime assist. I realize that. Huh. Kick it up. There you go. Oh, not like that though. Not the way to do it. Shit. Oh, there you go, son. I thought I had a lead there. I really did. Ah. Woof. Blocking, blocking. There you go. Holy shit, what was that pinball-looking crap? My God, all over the place. 
Bloop, 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 bloop. I mean, you can't blame the goalie for nothing on there. If I was him, I'd be pissed. That ball hit like five different people in a matter of two seconds, maybe less. Atlanta United goal, number seven, Joseph Martinez. Oh no. Oh no. Oh shit, right by me. Right fucking by me. There we go, all right. Let's crowd him up. Let's crowd him up. Yeah, whoever it's going to. Blue shoes! What are you, what are you doing? You should just call him suede. Because he's got them blue suede shoes? No, they're not suede. If you're wearing suede out there, you're gonna you're you're fucking terrible. You're slipping like terrible. Too much of a lead. Nope. Okay, he's got it. Good. Oh. Header nice. Oh, good save. Ah, shit. It's all right. It's all right. You like it a juice, huh? I right, want me to get back more. All right, fine, fine. I'll play to this dark green line I'm on. There it is. Really? I thought he hit the side. Wow. On the short edge, though. God damn. Well, that is a pistol whippage. We're in the 40th minute here. God damn. How do you get it on the short side, guy? And that goalie should punch it something. Just gonna boop, give it one of those. Oh. oh, you know, I was on uh, a little bit of a topic here a while ago. I was playing MLB The Show 16. Yes, I'm back playing that. But I was talking about... Oh, I'm sorry, this is the Super Nintendo Mini. Um, which I'm also giving to my brother. As soon as I go to va on my vacation in a couple of weeks here. But the NES Classic, the NES Mini, I was uh, also going to give him. But I was listing, uh, talking through the, the listing of games here. Uh, when I was playing the show, I guess I can continue where I left off. Um, so, whatever. Roll tight on that. <laughs> Thanks, Conrad. Those who know, know what I'm talking about. But, uh, I guess, alphabetically through this game list, uh, Metroid was the next game I think I was kind of talking about. And Metroid, hell of a game on the Nintendo. That was one, and, and like, I'm going back to where I, uh... I was a kid at that time, playing all that shit. And when you try playing Metroid when you're like, let's see, that game come out, what, 87, maybe 88? No, I think it was 86. So I'm four when that game comes out, but I didn't, I didn't play Nintendo right off the get-go from there. But, Metroid, a very confusing game. Very cryptic, like I, uh, I always say about uh, Legend of Zelda. It's like... You don't know where to go. Everything pretty much looks the same. More so, worse so, than Zelda. Really is. But, uh... With Metroid, you... It was just a very tough game to deal with as a young kid. Very tough. And they did one of the weird things where... The game starts off, and well, how do I advance? Well, you go to the left. And you'll get, you get your little rolling orb fucking uh, thing, you know? You'll get your, your roll attack deal. Not attack, but... Your morph ball, I think is what it's called. <laughs> Go get that ability immediately to the left. Because any other game is... Well, it's, it, it's all side-scrolling. You go... And you just... You, you start on the left and you go to the right. Like getting a Mario. That's what you did. The perfect 2D platformer. Zelda was more like the over-the-top that had to be offsides. Like Metroid, uh, man, I'll tell you, this... It was a very confusing game. Like, I, I get it now. I enjoy what that game is. Very ambitious for its time, without question. Oh, not hit... God damn it. Lasered it too quick. 
Let me block some people. Let me just get in their way. We're on offense, but let me get in their way. Let me just push some people. Not like that. I gotta be close to the ball. But with Metroid, like I appreciate it now as a kid. I didn't I didn't give a fuck all well, it, it was fun, but it was just too fucking tough. I never made it to Ridley or Craig. <laughs> never saw those fucking bosses at all. And I mean, without the Justin Bailey code, I had no clue how to get to the fucking end of that thing. None whatsoever. Oh shit, way up there with the marker. Oops. I had no clue where that was going. But Metroid, like I said, you know, much older now, I have a great appreciation for it. That was not a game that should have come out when it did. You know, Mario was tough, but simple enough. Side-scrolling, that's it. There's no special... I'm sure there were warp zones, but there was no, like, oh, fight. you got to find a key to get over here, and you need to defeat this specific boss in order to get to this area, and it's it was not like that. It just start to finish. Just go here. It was almost like a, like a race. Oh, man. Oh, blue shoes. Damn. Should have had the assist on that one, kid. I fed you. I fed you nice. Couldn't bend her in enough, huh? Son of a bitch. Steve-O is in the house. Welcome in, Steven. Cash Duckett to the late night live stream let's play of FIFA 19. I haven't played this in a little bit, so I'm kind of getting back in the groove. But what's going on, Steve-O? How are you, man? Let's get them quick passes going. Oh shit. Stay in position. Where the fuck do they really want me? Oh, run for it, kid. Now, bend it. Now, nah, hit him. The ball hit him, sorry. <laughs> what else on this NES mini uh, after Metroid? It's Ninja, Ninja Gaiden. I always thought it was Ninja Gaiden. Just missed. Just missed with the fucking, uh... I don't even know what kind of kick that is. Some Brazilian Jiu-Jitsu Capoeira type shit. That would have been amazing. Alright, can I just get a... Can I get a view of things here? Thank you, game. Come on. Who oh, shit. Oh... Well, that's the end of the first half. Yeah, Ninja Gaiden. I never played the original Ninja Gaiden on the Nintendo. I didn't. So there's a lot of that, like, I just, I can't speak on it. I don't know it well enough. And, uh... It looks very difficult. It, that's one of those games I was saying previously looks Nintendo hard. Or it is. It doesn't look it. It just fucking is. And that one with no exception. I mean, it, it's kind of, I would say, Castlevania, where it's kind of side-scroller. You got jumping and, and shit like that to worry about. Um, your passes have been laser-guided this season. Well, thank you. Thank you. And I must secure short passes. Getting better and better every day. That's how you're supposed to do it, Steve-O. you damn right. Just picture like what like picture how good yesterday was. Something about today was better than yesterday. Am I right? Look forward to that same thing tomorrow. It's like all right, today was pretty damn good, but something about tomorrow I will make it better than it was yesterday. Well, you'll be saying that tomorrow. You get the idea. But absolutely, getting better every day, every day, every day. That's good. The power of positivity. I'm trying to get myself into that mindset. I mean, I know I can be... I swear a lot when I'm playing video games and eh, I talk about my job this way, that way, whatever. But overall, I think I'm doing pretty good. Last year was great for me. In several ways, last year was, was really awesome. Oh, no. But, uh... I mean, this year... I admit, kind of a slow start by comparison of cool. But I still say, why did he kick it right to him? 
this year will be better than last year. I admit that. Ah, uh, shit. Put Ninja Gaiden back to the Nintendo games. <laughs> that one very difficult from, you know, I think my brother had rented it one time. I went over to a friend's house or something, like, whatever grade I'm in, like, second or third grade. Oh, there you go. Beautiful pass. Beautiful pass. So I can't speak on Ninja Gaiden, but that was a Nintendo hard kind of a game. I don't even know. My brother might not even want to go back to playing that. Oh, Pac-Man is the next game on the list. We all know Pac-Man. We all do. And the Nintendo port way better than what they were able to put on the fucking Atari 2600. That was just the drizzling shits. Goal. That and was just the drizzling United. shits. Number we seven, had uh, Pac-Man on the Atari, Martinez. what do we have, the 5200. And it looked really good. Did it look arcade game quality? I wouldn't go that far. But it was pretty damn good. way better. Dude, the 2600 was atrocious. Atrocious. Go. No. Slow him down, guys. Just get in his way. Just get in his way. Oh, shit. I don't know what these guys are trying to accomplish out there. But they're not accomplishing it. <laughs> but it's like, if you're a gamer and you don't know Pac-Man, it's like, I feel sorry for that person. I just do. We should hang out again. Yeah, you know, it's... it's Depending on the game, I, I don't know exactly what uh, like what's in right now for you know getting people rounded up. I mean, yeah, there's Fallout 76 again, of course. Well, that was a bad upper bend. Ah, shit. Yeah, just I would have to see. Well, I mean, well, we had Grand Theft Auto 5, but that kind of just I don't know. It's just that toxic community, man. That's what I didn't like about it. Uh, Fallout, I was going to say FIFA 76. Fallout 76. <laughs> I might make a new character in that, but again, like, uh, that would probably, like, take up a lot of my time. What, what am I doing? That was just a terrible pass. I mean, shit, what else do we have where we both know... You know, that we both have that same game. Ah. We had somebody in there that was a nice bending uh, cross. Ow. I mean, shit, I can't think of anything right now. There's, there's, there's Grand Theft Auto. <laughs> there's Fallout 76. Should help me. Maybe I'm missing something. Could be. So now we're getting into that spot where we're just letting them attack. Uh, pretty good lead, but that ain't going to do anything. Oh, I could be wrong. Holy shit, I'm surprised he even made contact. Oh, man. Number seven, Joseph Martinez. To be replaced by... Damn, close one. Brandon Vasquez. Ooh, oh, shit. Okay, I didn't want to do that, honestly. I didn't hit a button. It just, like, ricocheted off my chest. I didn't try going for it. Get it, blue shoes. Ah, bad lead. Well, uh, whatever. Ah, shit. What's next on the list? Gotta look for games. You got that, you got that. Let our guys set up here. Legends, what legends? Oh, Apex Legends, right. God, I suck at that fucking game. I haven't even started, like, streaming it just because I suck at it. Yeah, I mean, that is one we could. But my God, do I suck at that game.
Like, I, I would easily be the guy that brings the team down, and I don't think it's even close. Substitution for Houston Dynamo. Coming off the pitch, number 24. Punch out featuring Mr. Dream, which should be Mike Tyson's punch out next on our list. Yeah, dude, Mike Tyson's punch out or punch out, I realize the legalities that they have to drop the name. But punch out, shit. Just one of the best fucking. It, call it a fighting game. It's its own unique fucking game. And apparently it is based off of an arcade game, which I did not know until somewhat recently. No, buddy, you you ain't you ain't getting anywhere near that. Fucking box you out, son. But everybody knows Mike Tyson's punch out, punch out, whatever you want to call it. That game, such a uh, like I said, it's its own game. I mean, you think, oh, well, it's a boxing game. It's like, well, kind of. I mean, is it meant to be taken seriously? Well, yeah, but. Uh, but it's kind of cartoonish, it's cutesy in its own right. It's not so hardcore serious. It's not like Contra, where you have to save the fucking planet from an evil whatever. It's not that at all. Ah, uh, damn. There's a good lead. But with all the memorable characters in Mike Tyson's Punch-Out! You know, when you are just Little Mac and all that bullshit. Extremely memorable game, and, and I'll always refer to that one as, like, I think it kind of gets forgotten in the annals of, like, great Nintendo games. Sure, everybody's going to go Zelda, Mario, Metroid, all that stuff. The franchises, you know? They're going to do that. No. Damn it. A handful for defenders. I don't get that. What are they saying? Yeah, Apex Legends, I'll, I'll, I'll check in on that one. I haven't played it in a couple days already. Well, I haven't played much of anything recently. Been running around, you know. Well, you know. There we go. Boot that thing out of there. Good stuff. Just, I thought I'd be better at that game. You know, I was thinking, like, you know, Destiny 2, I didn't get back into that. I don't have all the, the DLC expansions and all that shit. I was thinking, like, oh, I might get back to that one. Then Apex Legends comes out, and it's free. And I'm like, okay, so it's Fortnite uh, with teams. Ah, uh, shit, come on, guy. You should have worked your way in. No, what the fuck was that game? You saw my arrow was aimed down left. Oh, fuck. Release the ball sooner. I wanted him to just take another step and take a shot. Get some energy back. Woof. Okay, okay. Hey, good feed out. That was nice. Feed out with your feet out. Wait, feed out with your feet out. You, you, you get it. Yeah, Mike Tyson's punch out. See, that's the problem. Like, I need to be playing a game where, like, nothing really matters. And I can just talk about old video games, because that NES Classic looks pretty good. I, I hope my brother enjoys that as much as I, I... Well, I just hope he really enjoys it. I'll say that. Nope, nope. I'm gonna box him out there. Throw some elbows a little bit. But yeah, I think everybody gets lost and forgets about... Everybody knows Mike Tyson's Punch-Out! is a great game. But I just feel that they forget about it, like with all the, the Marios and the Metroids and, you know, whatever else there is. It's like those big old franchises, Mike Tyson's Punch-Out! was like its own thing. And then, of course, Prison. Motherfucker, you're kidding me. God damn it, I was like right there, too. Yeah, go fuck your mother. Get out of here. Damn it. Well, guys, we can't let them get the last laugh. Let's go. 
Let's go. Game, why do you want me out here? Come on. Oh, shit. What happened there? Offsides? What do you do? I guess so. Well, how come I couldn't do that against the goal shot, huh? That was fucking horse shit. Oh, boy. No, 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 no. Just run into him. How did I not get a touch on that thing? There you go, kid. And they'll want me to play more mid. I don't know. Bad pass. Something I would have done. Up. What the fuck are you giving it to me for? Oh, horse shit. There you go. Oh, 24 was right there. I mean, that was money in the bank. Nope. Short passes. Let's make it count here. just got eaten up terrible just just terrible no you ain't doing that oh shit it's a long fucking cross though but yeah Mike Tyson's punch out and I gotta say like I remember uh, sitting at my friend's back porch well it was like an enclosed porch a back yeah whatever the back room of the house and uh, that was actually the first time I was playing... Uh, no, that was the first time I beat that game, too. It was like in 2000, I don't know, 2, 2003. And he had an old Nintendo ready up and going. But this was Punch-Out! featuring Mr. Dream. It wasn't Mike Tyson's Punch-Out! And that was the first time I'd beaten that game. I had one witness to it. There were other people in the house, but one person actually watching me play. And he's like, that's fucking great. I've never seen anybody beat that shit. I'm like, that's damn right. I felt kind of good about that. Then one time, I'm on vacation visiting my uh, my family. And my brother had this this cool little system. It had... Uh, I didn't call for the pass. I tried doing the fucking chest bump. This guy away from me. But my brother had this cool system that they would play... I think Nintendo, Super Nintendo, and Sega Genesis, like cartridges, like, like a three-in-one kind of a deal. And he had Mike Tyson's Punch-Out, and then a couple friends come over, and my brother's like, we're, we're going to go out to eat, and he's going to shower up, our friends are there, I think we maybe just got done watching some fucking DVDs or something they brought over, Rick and Morty or something, right? Like, okay, cool, I'm like, I was going to, you know, quick game of Mike Tyson's Punch-Out, I'm going to get that fired up. Oh, did I check out Detroit because the uh, human? Oh, uh, what the fu uh, that I know what game you're talking about. But uh, no, I I haven't. Ooh, I thought I had it went in. I'd have to check for it honestly. I have not checked on your channel yet, Stevo. Since we last talked, what was that? Last week, I think. We're getting ready to go uh, out of town, go grab some food at a nice place. And it's like, yeah, my brother's just taking a shower, cleaning up. Oh, you know, Mike Tyson's punch out. What does that take? Like, a half hour to play that game, no problem. And sure enough, right there, you know, with friends watching, I beat the fucking game straight through just on one shot. And even my friend, uh, he's just like, that's impressive. Just, <laughs> just did that just on a whim. I'm like, yeah, I don't have a Nintendo. I haven't been practicing for nothing. <laughs> like, shit, all right roll tight on that so there's my Mike Tyson's punch out stories next game on the list let's get it a squash here huh loop it bend it kick it go I got it bring it up to him why did you even try giving it to me 
Vision plus while you're you're going. Easy. Damn it. Oh. I'll take a shot. Uh, good shot, they said. I'll be damned. I didn't think it was. To be brutally honest. I just decided, fuck, take a shot. I would have went in, too. After Punch-Out, it is uh, Star Tropics, which is a unique, fun little RPG for uh, for the Nintendo. Why can't I move? Oh, there we go. Yeah. Oh. Oh, what, and then I got tripped up? Stay in position. Fuck you. Where's my stamina energy at? Terrible, actually. Oh, good interception. Good tackle, whatever you want to call it. Quick passes. Oh, too much. Why is the blue shoes? This blue shoes. Why aren't you running? What a fucking dink. But Star Tropics, I didn't know about that game till about 2010, honestly. I had no clue it existed. And I had my emulator at work, and I was, you know, just farting around. And buddy I work with, good friend of mine. Um, he's like, oh, dude, what about Star Tropics? You ever play that? I'm like, I don't, I don't know what is Star Tropics. He's like, oh, check it out. It's fucking awesome. It's got, like, the coolest song ever. And you know the song. <laughs> But I was surprised that he actually knew what the fuck that game was. He does not strike me as a, as a RPG kind of a gamer at all. And uh, he knew about Star Tropics, introduced to, introduced me to it. And I thought, all right, cool. No, but it is, it's one of those quirky things where, like... You shoot. No, I, I don't want to get a goal. Well, I mean, I do. I don't care, but... Shit, out of position. I gotta sneeze again. Fuck. Ah, I have to sneeze. Wow. Nope, I have to sneeze again. It's there. God damn, excuse me. Woo! Uh, YouTube sell cards. I'm not sure. Oh, oh, okay. I think that's for, uh... Yeah, I get you. Sell cards you would use, like, uh, I guess... Like, animation cells for, like, your, uh, your thumbnails or your videos or something. That's my thought. If I understand what... What the sell cards are. And now here comes the runny nose. I've had an allergy fit for, like, well over two weeks now. It's fucking garbage. Ah. And let it roll out. Oh, yeah, Star Tropics, uh... A pretty good, well-to-do, uh, RPG YouTuber... H.C. Bailey. Um, loves RPGs. Very thorough Let's Player on YouTube. Very fucking thorough. He damn near goes for 100%. <laughs> but uh, watching his Let's Play Star Tropics, he said, oh yeah, well this is the kind of game where you can't advance to the next part of the game unless you talk to everybody in the town or in that city or whatever. He's like, gotta do it. Absolutely. <laughs> One of his shtick things to say. Better than a sharp stick in the eye. <laughs> but he's good like that. Very thorough. Does really good uh, RPG Let's Plays on YouTube. So if you're good for, like, background noise or you really want to watch an RPG, you know, like, I'm telling you, I mean, several episodes. I mean, the Final Fantasy VII, VIII, all that shit. But he does it all. You know, games I've never played, and he's very thorough with it. Chrono Trigger, the whole deal. He's just, uh, does very well. Short episodes, does about 
10 minutes is kind of what he tries to keep it to. Oh, I was going to lead in. Calling cards. Huh. Like, I remember calling cards were a thing, like, back in the 90s. For, like, phones. I, I might, uh, I have no clue then. It's, unless it's, unless that's what they are, but I don't, I, I'll have to check on that. I'm not sure. Calling cards. Yeah, you know, like I said, to me, that's something from back in the 90s. But calling cards meant something totally different. Ah, shit. Poor position. No, I was, I was in great position. hi -ow. Oh. Why am I bitching? What the hell? Oh, we got a corner kick. We're good. Oh, shit. If I knew he was going to be trying to lead me in. Oh. And again, they got me on a tumble. Oh, come on now. Damn it. That was bad. Business card. You do business cards. What? You mean you put together your own, like, stream channel and all that stuff on there? Like... That seems a little bit extra to do, Steve-O. <coughs> I mean, hell, uh, maybe get an Instagram page or a... Uh... Excuse me, I'm having a coughing fit now. Oh, that hurts. I'll still never make it through this NES list. Super C, Super Contra up next, and that one a lot tougher than regular Contra for sure. Oh my god. Passing is poor. Make sure you know your teammate's position before you pass the ball. It'll be fine. But business cards, I mean... Yeah, Steve-O, no, I get you, like, as far as the branch out. What do you do for, for networking and such? Oh, that was some good setups. Oh, I thought he had that lower edge. Yeah, dude, we're almost at the 90th minute here. Oh, look at the fancy shit they're doing. Oh, post. Ah, shit. It's all right, we're here, we're here, we're here. Look at the fancy back and forth. Did they get the last laugh so far? I, they might have. Give out business cards so everybody can find you where you're at. It's not a bad idea, like, if you maybe go to gaming conventions and stuff like that. Because otherwise, yeah, you just reach out to people on, on their YouTube channel or on Twitter or Instagram and try to find all what they do. Oh, weak-ass kick, Mike. Poor shot. Yeah, it was. It was. I admit that. Well, that guy was right on him. Get in there, fellas. That nice just round up header. Ah. Uh, ah. Uh, stamina's getting weak. Oh, look at that. Sweepy kick. Surprised that shit worked. Oh, look at the lead. The double lead. Oh, motherfucker. That was beautiful. That would have been great. 
That would have been great. Yeah, I mean, I always say, Steve-O, you know, find me on Twitch, Twitter, and YouTube, all by the very same name. I mean, hell, if you want to know, if you got, you know, put your cell number on there, find some gamer girls, you know, <laughs> talk to them, say what's up. I mean, hell, just by sheer luck, I mean, you know, I got Melberries as a fan. <laughs> I want to say it was Fallout 4 back in the day. Although I have another uh, playthrough of that going right now, but... Game set match, 7-1 to one the final. And there's no way I'm going to continue to get through this list. Super Contra, it's tough as shit compared to the regular Contra. You know, I don't know. I'll try to get to talking about these games eventually. Like everything else. But, you know, when I play FIFA, shit goes kind of quick, which is kind of nice. Endless Animal. Would you look at that? He finally got the name of the game to show. You know, I'm trying, Animal. Plus, I remember we were talking about the NES Mini and all the games and all that shit. Oh, shit, I almost dropped it. We left off with Metroid. Or we needed to start with Metroid, I think. And I never got started with that because MLB The Show, I got called up to the big leagues and that was kind of a pain in the ass really was seven point four was I a was I a top performer no key dribbles no fouls no successful one-on-one -on -one dribbles no crosses two key passes completed 68 24 and 5 failed 5 6 and 1 no assists that sucks Shooting 50%. Three on, three off. Target, that is. Tackling. One, three, lost one. Positioning. Four interceptions. Out of position eight times. Yeah, it's fun. Ball retention. Possession. One, eight. Lost 18. Good God, I suck. One, three out of four headers. Woo. I should look into Sing Star. Steve, oh, I am not a Sing I, I don't. I don't sing. I was on a date last night. Like, oh, they're, they're doing karaoke. I'm like, I hear it. <laughs> Played all 90 minutes, though. I did that much. Um, what was the... Did I get accomplishments? Probably, eh, maybe one thing, yeah. I mean, this was performance, and that's all fine. Um... Saves. Seven. Let one by, son of a bitch. Tackles. Three out of four. I'm just not good at anything. Look at his dribbles completed. 107. Good God, everybody else just fucking... I don't know, dude. Passes completed. 71 out of 78. I do a lot of passing. I'm surprised. Goal assists. One. Just one assist through all what we did. Well, these are probably substitute guys. That's probably what happened there. Own goals? Nope. Match rating. 7.4 for me isn't bad. That's where I should be, I would guess. I have to leave school halfway through the day tomorrow to be on TV. Well, Animal, what the? You're, whoa, whoa, whoa. You're going to be on Cops, or what's the story here? Tell the people. What's going on? Uh, gonna be on TV, shit. It's a cool deal, though. Oh, boy. Whew. Whoops. My sinuses are just bugging the shit out of me. Oh, man. Well, we get the uh, get the win there, and then we start up in the standings. Is there? Can I like check the calendar to see how that fucking game cracked down? What is this? View the fixture. Sure. Um, hell, that's maybe not what I wanted to see. I have no idea. No idea what I'm looking at. 
Seven to one. Pick a competition. Like what the fuck? MLS. Um, change competition. R two L two. Oh shit! I see what's going on here. Yeah, round one. We beat Dallas. Grouping stage, we were 3-0. and Semi-finals, we beat Portland. Finals, we beat Chicago. What do you mean, pick competition? I want to see the breakdown of that individual game. I kind of lost track. If we had a goal... I th they might have got the last goal of the game. Like, the last laugh, I like... To, to call that and goddamn that would suck but we are number one going seven goals for well damn it I don't think I can show that individual thing that sucks huh warning advance of this date will do stuff I know I probably have some practice to do in between quite honestly I don't know my boss is going to be on TV and wants to bring me because I've been working for them for the last five years. Hey, shit. It's not who you know. It's who knows you. And if your boss is cool with that for whatever, maybe there's an interview piece or maybe they'll just have you, whatever your job is, uh, they'll just have you, they call it B-roll. Like if you're doing something on the computer or you're making food, whatever the job is, they might have a shot of you doing stuff, and like, ah, that's me on TV, and they're talking to my boss about the business and this, that, the other. Yeah, they might interview you. They might have you for B-roll. So, hey, either way, it's that's cool. I mean, if your boss has that much, uh, you know, respect for you in that regard, fuck, that's kind of, that's a good nod. That's a good tip of the cap. Like, no, you, come here, because TV's going to be here, and I want you a part of this thing. That's kind of cool, dude. That's really fucking cool. Whew. Well, my allergies are killing me. We played, we won. Houston Dynamo. Next up, it's going to be DC United. I think they're one of the better teams in MLS. So that'll be interesting. I probably have a couple of uh, practice sessions I can do in between all of that. So we'll see how that goes. It will be DC United the next time we play. And I don't know, how the hell do I do that exactly? Where would that go? Squad report, squad ranking, accomplishments, my career, my actions. Here's something that I looked at earlier, my actions. Um, request alone. I don't know exactly what that means. Do I have to, like, will I be launched over to some other organization? Like, it don't matter to me. I'll kick ass wherever I go to just maybe wait this out a little bit. I was originally scheduled to be there 6.30 in the morning, but luckily it got pushed back to 10.30 because normally I'm not even awake by 6.30. Yeah. Yeah, that's too fucking early for some people. Too early for... I wake up at 9 o'clock every day, and that's usually too early for me as well. Player developments. Is that where the practice comes? Yes. Okay. Um, are you sure you don't want to quit the training hub? Cancel. You know what? Let's do some training right now, everybody. Fuck. Dribbling. Well, let's do some... I mean, fuck it. Let's just go... Because that gives me stamina boost as well. And I want the stamina boost. For damn sure. So let's do that. Stamina. That's got to go up. Okay, add a drill. I think this is the first time in a while you haven't had a hat on in the stream while I'm here. Well, if I'm playing baseball, I usually wear the hat of the team that I play for. So that you, it, you'd usually see me with, uh, well, shit, MLB The Show 18. I was rocking a couple at that point. But I had the Angels on for the longest time. Defending. Ooh, interceptions. That's kind of important. Current growth and potential. Huh. 
dribbling, defending. Passing. Vision short and long. That's pretty much all it is. Crossing. I suck at crossing. I'm not even going to worry with that shit. I'll do medium between the dummies. At a drill. Shooting, really? Because I don't think that's something I need. Oh, I can still do passing. Huh. Oh, that's crossing. You know, what about defending? There's no more defending I can do? Ah, oh, shit. Against the keeper, first touch volley. Um. Whoops, no, go back to shooting. Shot power and finishing. Maybe. I do a lot more passing, though. Oh, that's going to be long pass with crossing. Huh. Well, then let's do the easy one. Drill number five. What's a set piece? Direct free kick novice. Shooting, I can do stuff. Passing, no. Defending, no. Dribbling, no. So it's either shooting... Shot power finishing, heading, ACC, and volley set pieces does what? Penalties and finishing. Oh no. Shot power, penalties, and finishing. Potential boost, you say? Oh man. Dude, I don't know. Precision penalty or direct free kick novice. They say that shit's hard, huh? Damn, I don't know. Uh, t -t 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 do you know if the show 11 is any good? I want to get some more games for my PSP. That's the newest one available. I have no clue. I started playing uh, show games back with uh, 13 on the PS3. I have no clue, man. Maybe... Maybe check some YouTube videos. Uh, Game Facts is always a decent reference. But I got no clue. I never played them that far back, honestly. Like, and I like them, but uh, I was just in a baseball funk. I hadn't played any in such a long time. Long shot practice. Shot power and finishing. Hmm. I'm going to try this shit, I suppose. Can't find your PS3, so I'd have to get one for your PSP, or an older one for the PS2 if they made them. No, for a PS2, if you're serious about a good baseball game, now, they don't have an individual player career, but uh, MVP Baseball 2005 for the PS2 is one of the best baseball games I had played. I mean, the show is good. But MVP Baseball 2005, it has Manny Ramirez on the cover. That was a great fucking baseball game. That one I enjoyed. Might have to buy a new PS3. Mine's been MIA for a few months. And if you're going PS3, the show 13 with Andrew McCutcheon of the Pittsburgh Pirates. Well, then. No headphones. No auto shutdown. But that was the first show game that I played, and it was I thought it was fucking beautiful. I mean, in a lot of ways, I enjoy that more than uh, everything else that I'd played since. And I mean that, even on you know, a PS3 game, I like better than a PS4 game. Sounds crazy, but so am I. Oh shit, we're going up top. I'm not paying attention here very well. Yeah, fuck your life. I just did stuff. Train the next player. They said that that performance was excellent. Rookie defending. Let's go get him. Get that shit out of there. Get him. Well, you better do something with it. Oh, now I'm literally in the way. I can't see because of me. Come on, buddy. Don't, don't, 
Come on, get the fuck out of here already, huh? Stay on ya. I'm gonna stay on ya. What you gonna do? What you gonna do? Buddy, come on, that's a backcourt violation. Come on. Where the fuck is he? I, I have no idea where he is. This is bullshit. Was I was I shutting him out that badly? That he had to run backwards that fucking that heavy? My god. Oh buddy, you you had that. Oh shit. Come on, buddy, I slowed him down. Oh, a little high off the post there, but Oh yeah, that was clean. That was clean. Go fuck your mother. That was clean. Uh-oh. Fuck that up. A B. Yeah. I tend to gamble on that. What's the deal with RBI Baseball? I saw 19 is coming soon to the Switch. Do you know if that series is any good? RBI Baseball goes back to the Nintendo in like 1987. Uh, now it looks a little more... It looks to me, at any rate, like a little more cartoony and... I guess, kid-friendly. It's not so simulation. It's more arcade baseball, I would say. But, um... For a quick pickup kind of a thing, that might be a good go. Otherwise, you know, the show... Like I said, the show is that long-term kind of... A baseball game you want to hold on to for a long time. Like I said, MVP 2005 would still be great um, if I weren't playing the show. Otherwise, the show 13 on the PS3, if you choose to get one of those... Um, yeah, I don't know the PSP, though. I really don't for that. What happened if YouTube... If YouTube send you a play... Wait, a play bottle. I don't... I don't get you, Steve-O. If YouTube sent you anything, that'd be kind of good, other than, like, a, a warning of, like, your videos are too... Like, if you swear too much, or if the content is too... too evil for people. Oh, okay, it's got to go right back the same way. Gotcha. Where are we going? Over here. Yeah. Uh-huh. Up top. There you go. There you go. I come back down here. No, motherfucker. He didn't walk far enough. Uh-huh. Over. And through. And up. And past. And down. And here. And yes. And good. And uh-huh. And now to... No, motherfucker, you. Excellent. That was excellent. I didn't think so. Hey, roll tide. All right. A play button with what, though? Oh, shit. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, fuck balls. Okay, that didn't go so well. Not quite what I wanted. Oh shit. Ah. Oh fuck. Try harder, they say. Yeah, there, that's what we needed. Hoop. Oh, buddy, you missed it there. That was a good job. All right, train the next. Whatever, it's a B. I'll take a B. First touch volley. No idea. I think this is like on a pop fly coming at me. You have to see what this is all about. Because, uh, other than I don't have a clue, I don't have a clue what I'm doing. I really don't. Yeah! How about that, huh? Oh, look at how weak that was. Too early. Oh, wait, what the... I don't get it. Huh. Oh, I see there's a timer bar in there somehow. Okay. Whoop. Whatever. Ah, shit. Oh, pfft. I don't know what I'm doing. Blammo. That was fucking... Great timing. 
Okay. That was decent and fun. Retry. I mean, hell, if they're alive. No, whatever. See the results. I don't give a shit. We're done training. Yay! Ball control went up. Stamina went up. I need that stamina. I need, like, sprinting speed, too. Need that like a motherfucker. Uh, presets. Quit training. Yeah, because we're done. I guess that's good. Yeah, how do I raise my running speed? Like, what can I do for that? Because I need to do that. Atlanta United FC. What's this all about? Gress allowed five days with shoulder. We don't play for a while. He'll be fine. Well, there you go. A little bit of training before we jump out. DC United, our next opponent on the 11th. People get a play button from YouTube uh, from subscription. Okay, from subs. That's cool. Well, shit, okay. I mean, if you got a good uh, following there, build that shit up and go with it. Get you some buttons and such. Woo! I I need to fight out my allergies, and it's a little stuffy in here right now. Not gonna lie. I know I live in South Florida, but it feels warm in here. Gonna have to fix that. Maybe fix myself a drink as well. Swig of water for everybody checking things out here live on the Twitch side of things. Uh, from the top, Steve-O coming in. Animal jumping in saying, hey. Any other lurkers, thanks so much for checking it out. If you watch episodically on YouTube at your own leisure, I thank you all as well. Uh, I'm an allergy-riddled mess. What's new? Cheers to you, by the way. Because that water is just so fucking tasty. I am going to roll out. I've had a long past couple of days, like, not getting a lot of sleep. Been out being an idiot with people, so... Whew. Weird title for a FIFA stream. I know, well... They don't call it a field, they call it a pitch. You know. It's like, oh, a beautiful matchup on the pitch today. So, you know, out on the pitch, I'm the curveball. I'm the odd one. It's kind of a sports pun, baseball... I don't know. But yeah, so I named the episode On the Pitch, I'm the Curveball. I mean, it makes sense if you know me. That's all I got. Thanks so much, <laughs> Steve-O and Animal, for checking things out. Don't know what I got planned for tomorrow, although I should be streaming regardless. Unless, you know, distractions happen, which happens. I mean, fuck, it's Wednesday. I didn't stream Monday or last night. Normally, I try to stream a good, you know... At least Monday through Thursday, because Friday night I usually go out and I become quite the idiot. But, uh, it happens. So I haven't played this in a little bit. It was good to kind of get back into it. Kind of nice. Well, a couple of guys at work were talking about, uh, there's a bunch of... I don't even know what league matches there were today, but, uh, they really dig football. So I'm like, you know what, fuck it, I'll get into that. That's cool. And there we did, 7-1. to one. Didn't have an assist, though. Didn't have a goal. Damn it. We'll work on that. This will be a long career. This this will take me forever to get anywhere marginally, like, through this career. Got no clue what I'm doing. I just don't. Again, thanks so much. Swig of water was taken care of. We're good. I think we're all good to go. I think we're good to go. And on that note, the usual. MJ signing out for now. Till we meet again, everybody. I don't know when or where that's exactly going to take place. I'm not quite sure what game we'll be playing the next time you and I cross paths specifically. But all I do know is that I will indeed catch you down the road.